So today we're gonna tour my remote year apartment here in Santiago, Chile. For those that don't know, my name is Kevin and I was in the military for 20 years. I became a corporate lawyer and I kind of got fed up with the nine to five. So I quit my job to travel full time. So if that kind of content interests you, please subscribe below. So I've been in Santiago, Chile for about a week and I figured it was about time to give you a tour of my apartment. This is my second apartment with Remote Year. My first one was in Lima, Peru. And if you haven't seen that video, I'll go ahead and link it somewhere up here. But for now, let's jump right into this. I live in a really hip neighborhood here in Santiago, just south of Bella Vista. And my building has this really cool mural by a famous local artist. I live on Mosquito Street, which is more like a little alley. And it has all these really cool outdoor cafes, a chocolate shop, pastry shop. It reminds me a lot of Europe, actually. Which brings me back to my apartment building, which reminds me so much of the apartments in the Latin Quarter in Paris. And just like the apartments in Europe, the hallways are a little bit dark, kind of dingy, smell a little bit like cigarette smoke. Um, just the normal uh, thing you would expect from a old world style apartment building. So the elevator situation in this building is very interesting. This elevator is probably like a hundred years old at least, maybe even more. It has this little accordion type of thing that you have to close in order for the elevator to work. And also when you get out of the elevator, you have to close it or it won't go back down. And you'll make the other residents kind of mad. Another thing, if you open the accordion before the elevator stops, it'll stop the elevator. And I've done that on more than one occasion when it's when the elevator's kind of slowed down on my floor. See how it's going really slow here? And I've opened it up like to get out and it stopped and I had like a foot more to go. So I had to like jump up to get out of the elevator. So um, yeah, it's <laughs> it's small and, and um, I question the safety of it, but I use it anyway, because I'm too lazy to walk up the stairs. I never use it going downstairs though, I always walk downstairs. So this apartment is a two bedroom, one and a half bath that I share with another person that's also on remote here. So we'll go ahead and start here in the living room. We have these great French doors that bring in a lot of natural light. This apartment has air conditioning units in each room, which is kind of rare in Latin America, but we haven't really needed them because it gets down to the high 40s, low 50s at night here. So next we'll head into the kitchen here and if you watch my other videos, you'll know I don't cook and neither does my roommate. So this is a waste of another really nice kitchen. I know I keep coming back to this French theme, but this kitchen kind of reminds me of like a country French bistro type of kitchen. And lastly in the kitchen, we have this refrigerator and a washer dryer combo. One of those units that does everything. And right off the kitchen, we have this little half bathroom. So as I mentioned earlier, I have a roommate He's not in the apartment right now, but he gave me permission to go into his room. So I won't go too much in there. I don't want to invade his privacy, but I'll kind of show you what he's got going on there because it's pretty cool actually. So the room is pretty standard, but what's cool about it is he has this French door that gives him access to the balcony, which is really cool. Both of our rooms come with a flat screen TV and cable, but neither of us really use it. And lastly, we'll move on to my bedroom. Sorry to disappoint, but it's pretty standard. Other than some pretty unique artwork, which I think might be like a Banksy or something. I just have a bed, a nightstand, and a desk, and a window. So, pretty basic. So lastly, I'll show you our only full bath. And it's kind of a unique situation, or at least it's a unique situation for me. I've never had this before. Me and my roommate both have doors that access the bathroom and they can only be locked from the inside of the bathroom. So that's kind of odd, but we've come up with a schedule and we're dealing with it. And uh, the bathroom's nice though. I mean, it's got a nice shower. It's just kind of an odd arrangement. So lastly, I'll show you one of the coolest things about this apartment, the balcony. So this is just one of those really nice things to have. The weather's pretty good here in Santiago, so it's pretty awesome to just come out here and sit, drink coffee in the morning, work on my computer. We even have a barbecue pit here. So that's the Santiago apartment, the one I'll be living in for the next month here in Santiago. I'm planning on doing a lot more videos here in Chile. I'm going to Patagonia, 
to some hot springs, to wine country. So if that kind of content interests you, make sure you hit that subscribe button below. Thanks for watching.